Welcome back, one and all, to Red Dead Redemption 2. I am the Dark Seraph, and last time, we got off that frickin' mountain, and now I can go about the world as I see fit. I can, I can shave. Excuse me? Excuse me! Oh my god, that is freaking amazing detail. I can friggin' shave, and I think he looks... I guess he has got to grow back with time. Let's just stick to the good old mustache. And I can't do anything with hair yet. Okay, that is a nice bit of detail. I can go get a shave. Okay, I cannot pull out my guns and camp. I can take the horse out and I can do my thing. Let's go for a ride. Okay, and I should be able to pull up the map. Yes. So let's go off into the wilderness. I don't even know where I'm going, I'm just going. Excuse me. Hey, I'm just chatting, buddy. Relax. Just want to talk. I told you to stop. You soft in the head? Sorry, it's just too much fun. Stop. This is your last chance. Fine, I won't talk to you then. Hey there. Morning, sir. Ah. See? You were a nice enough chap. That's all I wanted to do was say hello. Whoa, um, hello. Hello? Whatever. So there is wildlife out here. Let's do some hunting, sure.
Wrong way. Up. Okay, let's just keep following the trail. Oh, there it is. Let's just keep following it. Stay low and slow. Ain't close yet. Take a drink. Got a spot of tea with me. Oop, just bumped the mic. Didn't mean to do that. Oop, wrong button. That's fun. Oh, poor thing's suffering. Well, don't worry, little guy. I'll put you out of it. Up. I'll put you out of it. It's a deer of some kind. There you are, Walker. Good to see you. Now, where is the camp? Right here. Yeah. Come on, let's go skin this thing and find a way to sell the hide. Have to find a way around the bend. That shouldn't be too hard, though. Oh. Well. Made it back to the camp real fast. Guess I wasn't far out. Careful with that horse, Arthur. Okay, take it easy.
Now, where am I taking this thing? Provisions. Okay. That's the wrong button. I keep trying to bring that to bring up the map. The butcher. Okay. Are you gonna join us, Arthur? In a bit. I'm gonna just stop doing my own thing. After all, we need supplies, we need food. What's this? That's Mr. Morgan. Oh, I just passed the damn butcher. You know these hides and furs can also be done up into coats and boots and such. Beyond my skills, but there's a trapper that travels around these parts, Canadian feller, skill tanner. He can make just about anything. You should drop in on him sometime. Yeah, yeah, I know. Thanks, Pierce. Just in time, Mr. Morgan. Many thanks. There we go. Thank you, Arthur. I keep hitting that to bring up the map because I'm stupid. What game did I play where is the touchpad to bring up the map? Another day. Morning to you. Wake up. Ow! <laughs> Careful That's one way to, to wake him up. To death there, Uncle. I was thinking. Yeah, does it pay well? Oh, eventually. So, while the rest of us are busy stealing, killing, lying, fighting, Hunting. try to survive. You get to think all day. Yeah, it's a strange world we live in, Arthur Morgan. Hey, you want to head into town? See if we can find anything out? Sure. I got some errands to run. Great. Go check the horses are ready. <sighs> It'd be good to know my way yeah, around the town. Take the old man into town. Can you take us too? Well, what you got planned? Nothing. We'll find something for y'all to do. We always do. We're bored out of our minds. Been cooped up here for two weeks now. Karen's about ready to murder Grimshaw. <laughs> Can Miss Grimshaw spare you? <sighs> Can Miss Grimshaw spare you? What's happened to you, Arthur? Three young, healthy women want you to take them a robin. You're worried about house chores. Let's go. Yes. Fair enough. You got me. Come on in. <laughs> I can't believe we're going to see civilization. Feels like weeks since we did. Yeah, Valentine. <laughs> Very embodiment of civilization. <laughs> ladies are going to love it. Okay, then. Let's go. All right. Out through the trees here, then take a left. Yep. Shouldn't you pull the back of the cart up? Yeah, that PS4 fan is a running. Forgive me if I sound a little bit stuffy. My allergies are acting up. It's still a bit cold, even though springtime weather is coming upon us. Not even kidding. I'm not. Lady, a song. Oh, 
<laughs> this is very charming. Let's do some first person a little bit. There is another coach. Should we help him out? Yep. Is one of you gonna get that fella's horse? Well, I got lumbago. It's very serious. I'll get it. All right, I'll see what's going on. Lumbago, really? I'll be a good Samaritan for now. You all right there, friend? Oh, hey, you couldn't help me get my other horse back from over there, could you? Yeah, sure. Sure, no problem. Thanks. It's the white one over there. Yeah, I see it. Hold on, let's take it nice and slow. You cool? You okay? Ah, just a scratch. That went well. Easy. It's okay. Here. Here you go. You're a gentleman, sir. A gentleman. No, not really. I was just trying to impress the women. <laughs> <laughs> well, anyway, thank you. You're quite welcome. What, no reward for my good Samaritan service? I'd just shoot your ass. But I won't. But I could. But I won't. Even though I could. Should I? Should I shoot his ass? I ain't gonna shoot his ass. Come on, let's go. <laughs> Even though I could. You're turning into a regular old fairy godmother there, Arthur. What's that supposed to mean? It means you got a heart. A small one, perhaps, oh. hidden deep inside, but a real one. And you haven't, your pulse of old lizard. <laughs> Lizards have hearts. Well, Arthur, I'm proud of you. To be honest, if you lot hadn't been here, I probably would have robbed him. <laughs> well, you did it. <laughs> Let's slow it down. Take it nice and steady. <laughs> or is that uncle? <laughs> oh, very funny. This looks like a decent little town. Other people, finally. Look at all that snow on the mountains. Sure don't want to be back up there. You think we should have asked Molly to come with us? Oh, no. Miss O'Shea is far too high and mighty now for the likes of us. <laughs> or any real work. She's a society lady now. Okay. Take a good look around, ladies. Let's see what we got here. Hey there. 
there, partner. Morning. Hello, gentlemen. Morning. What? You looking for trouble? Maybe. Mister? Morning, partner. Go left here, down the main street. Drugs. Sheriff you office. Some bounties there, Arthur. Heaven forbid you put your head on the line. <laughs> Good to know. I can pick up bounties at the sheriff's office to get extra money. We can get up to some mischief here, all right. Saloon. Keep a low profile. Will you remember that though? General store. Let's park up down the end there. Blacksmith. I'll do some shopping. Got a bit of money. All right. Here we are, just like I said. Cultural center of civilization. <laughs> Man at his finest. Uncle, what are we doing? Well, we're going to do what any self-respecting maniac does. Put the women to work. <laughs> With pleasure. We'll start at the saloon. Okay, just stay out of trouble and don't get yourself noticed. Right, I need to get something from the stores. Okay, well, we'll see you at the general store when you're done. Come on, lady. Donation for the poor? Buddy, I am the poor. So that's how you see yourself, is it? A maniac? Well, in my youth, I used to be known as the one-shot kid. <laughs> okay. I'm not gonna ask why. You are a sad man, Arthur Morgan. But I know you love me. Desperately. You're my favorite parasite. <laughs> no. Ringworm's my favorite parasite. You're my second favorite parasite. <laughs> Very funny. <laughs> right. Ringworm. Then rats with the plague. Then you. <laughs> this is the place. Now. Come on. Morning. So, what do you need? Hell, a drop of whiskey for a start. You know, something to pass the time while we're waiting on the women. Always thinking ahead, ain't you? You look at the there, uh, fishing? I can go fishing? Why don't you pick up some coffee while we're here? Okay. Let me know if you have any questions, fellers. Whiskey's on the top shelf, nearest the door. Provisions. Canned goods. Uh, apricots. Apricots, excuse me. You like beans, anything, corn, peas. Uh, I don't know. Maybe. Just looking. Uh, poison. So, you're actually buying for once? Are you feeling all right? See this? Young folk got no respect for their elders no more. What are you ready? Lamb or a sausage? Well, this here's a sheep town. The lamb's the best in the state. Man, I know what the smell what is. What they got in tobacco? Oh, that's a ripe cheese, all right. Some brandy, gin, rum, Kentucky bourbon. Cigar. All done. Thank you kindly. Ah, <laughs> this should do the trick. Yep, that's fine whiskey. That should do us. Let's go oh, wait for the, the wrong side. button. Peter cartridges. I'll take a case. Some rifle cartridges, some shotgun cells. I'll just take a little bit of everything. Hunting and fishing. Some arrows. Always good to have arrows. Bait. Horse care. Got to take care of my horse now. Do not be cruel to your horse. No shit. How about some clothing now? You got a nice hat for me? I can get a trilby.
or Panama hat, which is uh, it's been like a fedora. Yeah, I'm fine with what I got. Okay. Well, accessories, sure. Why not? Some rifleman gloves, uh, sure. That looks good. Oh, and I can just buy off the shelves. That's cool. Excuse me, how can I be out of cigar how can they be out of cigars if they are sitting right there? It's a bold faced lie is what it is. Oh, here's your good health, sir. <laughs> What's left of it? Off that mountain. Absolutely. It's a funny world, you know. This time in my career I pictured myself being married to an heiress. I'm sure. Gentlemen, I think I got something good. What? What? I snuck into this fancy house, acted like a servant girl. Usually works. Someone was saying her sister was taking a trip from New York or someplace. Train full of rich tourists heading to San Denis and then cruising off to Brazil. Okay. A train laden with baggage and passing through a bit of deserted country at night as to get to the docks in time for the tides in some place called Scarlet Meadows. Yeah, I know it. Yeah, yeah, it's right out near New Hanover. <laughs> right, it's real quiet out there. Sounds good. Uh, Where's Tilly and Karen? I think at the hotel. They were picking up some drunken fellas that they was gonna rob. Why? It seemed easy. They have been gone for quite a while. I guess I'll go see if there's any trouble. Oh, there's Tilly over there. That does not look ideal. Excuse Looks like me. trouble. Get your hands off me. You thought I wouldn't find you, Tilly. You can go kiss a damn snake for all I care. Get off me. Get your hands off her. Who are you? A friend of mine. Get the hell off her. Son of a bitch. Hey. Hey, take it easy. There's no problem here. There will be if you don't get out of here right now. Fuck off! You're making a big mistake, Tilly Jackson. Just... Um, I wasn't aiming at his head. I, I, I wasn't aiming at his head. What, well, was just shooting? Enough to do that. Get your hands off me. I'll find you, Tilly. Huh? You can go kiss a damn snake for all I Get your hands off her. Who are you? A friend of mine. Get the hell off of her, you son of a bitch. Hey. Hey, take it easy. There's no problem here. There will be if you don't get out of here right now. You're making a big mistake, Tilly Jackson. Just get lost. I ain't get doing this with you right now. Out of here. Go wait with Uncle and Mary Beth. They're across the street. Okay. Thanks, Arthur. Do I need to take care of him? Uncle! Look after her. I'm gonna go see about Karen in the hotel. Ah, oh, great. Can I help you, sir? I'm looking for a girl who came in here earlier with a drunk fella. Mid-twenties, blonde. You'd remember her. Yeah, they're in 2B upstairs. Are you, uh, a friend of his? A friend of hers. 2B up the stairs. No, this is not... I'll try my best. I'm getting what I'm paying for. 
Okay. Fine. You sure? Yeah. Nothing. Nothing to worry about. Just men. But stupid bastard. Stupid bastard was boasting about the bank. Bank? Sure, I know small town banks are usually a waste of time, but this is a livestock town. There's lots of cash sometimes. Okay. Keep investigating. Okay. <laughs> You're gonna want to send someone to pick him up. I kicked. I kind of beat his Thank face you, in. Arthur. I don't much like being saved, but when I have to be. I understand. You okay? Sure. He only punched me. Arthur punched him a lot harder. <laughs> hey, who's that guy over there looking at us? Weren't you in Blackwater a few weeks back? Me? No, sir. Ain't from there. Oh, you were. Well, I definitely saw you with a bunch of fellers. Me? No. Impossible. Listen. Buddy, come here for a minute. I saw you. Come here. Come on, get. I don't like this. Me neither. Go get the girls home. I'm gonna go have a word with our friend. Be careful, oh, Arthur. this ain't Just any good. Word. Yeah. Get hey, that's my horse. Just borrowing it. You stay away from me. Get back here right now. Where'd he go? Shit. There he is. That's far enough. Uh, I think I done dealt with him. Please do something. Well, hi. Why are you telling lies about me? No, no. I, I, I got it wrong, partner. I got it very wrong. Now please help me up. I ain't never been in black water. Then why are you chasing me? I've got an unfortunate face. Yes, yes, me too. Now please pull me up. Please. Please. Sure, I'll pull you All up, right. buddy. Come on. You okay, partner? No. No, I am not. You're about to be a whole lot worse. I'm a mess. Well, you ain't dead. There is that. Jimmy Brooks. I think it's best for both of us if we pretend this never happened. Well, I agree. You saved my life. You're a good man, and I, uh, here, you want a pen? It's one of them steel ones. Oh, that's very kind of you. <laughs> but I'm not a good man, Jimmy Brooks. Not usually. You see, I was in Blackwater. I killed people. And maybe I should have killed you. Should I have killed you, Jimmy Brooks? Me? I never saw you. Not, not now, not, not never. I think we have an understanding? Yeah, of course we do. Jimmy Brooks. <laughs> I will remember that. I've got a good memory. I haven't. I haven't. Not, not one lick. Not one... Sorry, Jimmy Brooks. <laughs> what, did you expect me to let him walk off? Nah, fucking shot him. <laughs> eh. 
And now can I pick your ass up? No. I don't I don't know where the horse went. Oh that guy was a wild horse that ran off. Yeah. Let's bring you back. Oh, Javier's in town. Let's go bring the horse back. Hey, my horse. Am I glad to see you? Yeah. Here's your horse back, friend. Oh, you really want to get far on it. Appreciate yeah. it. I ain't gonna rob ya. I shot the other bastard, but uh Uh, so what am I doing now? Well, actually, I've been going for a good while. So, no, no, no. So I'm going to end this one here. Thank you all for watching. Join me next time on Red Dead Redemption 2 as I continue my life of crime. But until then, I am the Dark Seraph, signing off.